do it at the national news level. And you're going to get it from the best team ever put on the field. There is nothing more vital than local news. When you need us, we're here. KXAN Austin News is keeping you connected. Weeknights. Welcome back. Well, the Seton Heart Institute, a member of the Seton family of hospitals, is performing life-saving, minimally invasive cardiac procedures. Dr. Matthew Rogers, an interventional cardiologist at the Seton Heart Institute, is the first in Central Texas to treat critically ill patients with the world's smallest heart pump. He joins us in the studio this morning. Good morning. Thank you. Yeah, thank you for coming in. So describe exactly, you brought in the device. Yes. What is it? How does it work? It's a small pump that takes over the function of the heart during a dangerous angioplasty type procedure that in a very critically ill patient they may not be able to survive. Someone who has such weak heart function that even interrupting the blood flow to their to their heart for a short period of time will cause their heart to stop. This, this device allows their heart to continue functioning during that time period and allows us to fix seriously narrowed arteries in the heart while this is taking over the function of the heart stop the procedure, remove this device, and they're fine afterwards. Is there a simple way to kind of explain how this device works? Uh, there is. It's a, uh, it's a small Archimedes screw type device, which is a screw that causes suction along the shaft of this catheter, bringing blood from the main pumping chamber of the heart out into the aorta. So if the heart doesn't work perfectly during the time period we're repairing these arteries, then this takes over that function, keeps the blood flow moving through the system, keeps them from dying during the procedure. Yeah, I was going to say, what happened prior to getting this? Well, mainly these patients were so sick that they weren't able to be treated and they were placed on hospice or, or uh, just treated with medications and, and lived out their lifespan as long as they could. We just didn't have any way to treat these patients. They couldn't go through bypass operations. They couldn't go through angioplasties. Now we have something available to help those people. So who out there would be eligible for this kind of treatment? Those patients with either severe heart, heart dysfunction where their hearts are so weak they've been told by their doctors they can't have an angioplasty, they can't have a bypass operation to fix their blocked arteries. For those patients who've got narrowings in their arteries who have other medical problems, severe lung disease that prevents them from going through those type of procedures. Interesting. And the people that you performed this on over the last year, are these individuals who have already had previous surgery? Many of them have. Many of them have already had bypass operations to go back through another bypass operation would, would place them at even higher risk of not surviving that. Many of them have been through angioplasties before as well. And by using this device during the surgery, does that in end help prolong their life as a result of getting this surgery? It definitely stabilizes their function and allows them to get a better quality of life, have less chest pain and less angina. The data about prolonging life is still kind of preliminary. Gotcha. And so are people coming from all over the state or all, all over the country over the for state. this? All over the state. We're the only place in Central Texas performing this procedure at Seton Medical Center, Austin. There are other places in the state, Dallas and Houston, that perform the procedure. And we only have a couple of seconds left, but for somebody watching out there who thinks, gosh, this would be perfect for my husband or wife or somebody in my family, um, how do they get in touch to figure out if they could get this? Call the Seton Medical Center, Austin, and ask for the Seton Heart Institute, and they'll connect you to our number. Excellent. Thank you, Dr. Matthew uh, Rogers. Thank you for joining us this morning. Thank you we very certainly much. appreciate it. Certainly very interesting. All right. Well, now let's go over to Rhonda for today's forecast. All right. And a good forecast it is. A beautiful sun drenched dome there. Taking a look at the traffic cam, not bad there at all. This is I 35 near 51st Street. Guys, keep driving safely. Thank you so much for that. And looking at the temperatures across the area right now in Maybury, it's 76. And at the airport, it is 77 degrees, cloudy skies across the the board. Humidity a little on the high side and it's going to stay that way. Oh yeah, I'll have your summer forecast for you in a moment. Keep it here. She'll be coming round around you when she comes. She'll be coming Ooh, one flag. Six flag. This summer, have more fun at America's number one show park, Six Flags Fiesta Texas. Now, for a limited time, everyone pays kids' price. That's right, everyone pays kids' price at SixFlags.com or with coupons from Dairy Queen. More flags, more fun, Six Flags. Baby, I'll pay the sole of milk because you're on a tour.